Hello and welcome. Today I'll be having a look at the JBL Everest 300s. Okay, so this is a box as you can see. It's a wireless headset, Bluetooth, Everest 300. There is a 300 Elite version that has a gold uh, accent on the headset. Uh, and it also features uh, noise cancelling. This model does not have noise cancelling. So this is the rear side of the box, as you can see, Bluetooth form 0.1 uh, and some more branding. Uh, it also boosts a 20 hour rechargeable battery, which is also quite useful. So let's have a look inside, shall we? Uh, it does have a convenient black tab here, as you can see. So when you pull on it, as you can see, this is an outer casing and it's fully removable. So let's just throw that aside and this is what we're left with. It's a quite nice box. As you can see, the sides still remain, but the top and the bottom is changed. So as you can see, there is no tab over here, but it's quite easy to lift. Uh, JBL by Harman. And here you can see the headset itself. Uh, the box features some nice orange accents. Um, here you can see the headset itself. You can see some instructions right over here near the buttons. These are the four buttons. So it's on, uh, hold for three seconds. Uh, this is uh, a special pairing mode that I'll talk about in just a second. And here we have volume up down and pause. Okay, so when you remove the headset, as you can see, it's quite nice, has an adjustable hinge. It has a foldable design. Uh, the JBL 300s do not come with a case. However, the uh, 300 Elite version does come with a case. So let's set this aside for a second. Uh, there is a convenient tab over here. And when you pull it up, you can see deeper into the box. Uh, there is some paperwork over here uh, that does get stuck quite well. So here you can see just your standard paperwork and some warranty that's surprisingly in Chinese. I have opened this. Uh, it does come with a, a cable, uh, so that's quite convenient. It does not come with a brick. So as you can see, it's a universal pamphlet for 300s and 300 and 700s, excuse me. And it has instructions in all languages. So if you need to have a look at it, just pause the video. Okay, so that was that. Now let's have a look at the headset. Okay, so this is the headset itself. It has a JBL logo right over here and on both sides. Uh, the buttons, uh, the volume up and down buttons do not have any indicators on them, but the power on and special pairing mode do have a, a light indicator. There's also a charging indicator right over here. You can see there is a cable a mini jack input right over here and the micro USB charging port. They're unfortunately not USB-C, but for the price, one only hopes for so much. Okay, so the padding is quite nice. It is memory foam and it's quite squishy as you can see. Uh, it has a left and right indicator on an inside. Um, there is some writing on the inside of the collapsible hinge. There is a model number right over there. And these do sound quite nice. Uh, the sound is very well cancelled. I can, uh, although they do not have active noise cancellation, I still do not hear basically anything when I'm wearing them. Uh, the battery is also very nice. The battery is completely housed in these white blocks over here. There is no, nothing over here. It's also very squishy. Um, and the battery holds for about a week uh, of about one hour to one and a half hours a day. Uh, so it's about uh, 15 hours, I'd say. And they do charge quite quickly. 
uh, they do support fast charging, but they do not like charge that fast, unlike uh, the Beats headphones. But of course, they are quite a bit more expensive. Okay, so now concerning price and availability. Right now, you can get these on Amazon for about $100 to $150 with eligibility for international shipping. So these are a very good deal. I do recommend them and yes, feel free to check out the link in the description. Okay, so this concludes today's review. Feel free to like, subscribe and check out my other videos.